What's up, guys? Let's talk about what is phone flipping. Okay, so my name is Chris Schroeder. I'm a full time phone flipper, reseller, uh, marketer, I'm a couple of different things. Um, so basically, I wanted to explain phone flipping in a nutshell today and how it works, how you can make money doing it. And I'm not talking about where you take the phone and you literally flip it in your hand. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about phone flipping and reselling iPhones and Samsungs and stuff like that for profit. Okay. So before we get started, if you guys would please like, subscribe, uh, follow me, leave me a cool comment. Let me know what you think about this. Okay. And let's get started. So what is phone flipping? So phone flipping is where we buy a phone and then we resell it on platforms such as eBay, Swappa, or to somebody we call a direct buyer, which then we make a profit on between the, on the margin of the price that we bought it for and the price that we sold it for. Okay. So how all of this works is um, I'll show you guys the first way this works and how you can get your first phone um, to resell. And, uh, and then we'll kind of go from there. So I'm going to show you guys a couple of different methods. And then I'm going to show you guys the one that I highly recommend. Okay. It's really only going to be like two methods because that's pretty much all there is. So let's, let's start, right? So a lot of people start this business on Facebook marketplace or something similar to that. Okay. So let's, let's start here. So as you guys can see, um, there's phones listed for sale on Facebook marketplace and a couple of, you know, a couple, here's an 11 pro max unlocked, right? Here's a, here's an iPhone 12 pro max, by the way, this one's fake. Um, but this is, I don't really do a whole lot on this, um, but this one is definitely a fake because it has the old iPhone X background. Um, so this isn't one you would want to buy, right? So um, that's something to watch out for on these platforms. But some, what a lot of people start off doing is by reaching out to people on this platform and trying to get them at a lower price, okay? So this person here, is selling an iPhone 13 Pro Max one terabyte unlocked for $500, okay? So one thing that we want to do is figure out exactly how much that device is actually going to sell for online. So let's look it up. We're gonna to go to eBay real quick and uh, use that as an, oh, I already have eBay open. Then we're going to type in, uh, I believe, it, what was it? iPhone 13 Pro Max, yep, let's go to eBay iPhone 13 Pro Max, um, and they said unlocked, one terabyte. I believe it was unlocked. Yep, unlocked one terabyte, perfect. Let's just go back here. Okay, so then what we're gonna wanna do is we're gonna wanna go down here to um, sold items, just like that, whoops. <clears throat> and then we're going to want to uh, make sure it, it's used, the condition. And then we want to make sure it's buy it now. So this is going to show up with a bunch of sold prices, right? So here's a new listing. This one's sold obviously pretty quickly uh, for $1,300. Um, so this one is selling for around $1,300. So this looks like a good flip. Looks like it. So let's actually do a little bit more digging. Uh, phone is like new, not a mark anywhere. It comes with a box and cable. I don't sell outside eBay, so don't try. It's interesting because it's on Facebook Marketplace. You will receive your item in three to five days. Okay. So one thing I'm a little skeptical on this one is uh, this looks like a fake as well. It's also priced like really low for, and also the pictures are terrible quality. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure this is a fake I'm because I'm pretty sure this is the uh, 12 Pro. It might even be the 11 Pro box. You can also see there's some discrepancy in the cameras here a little bit. So also the photos are really blurry. So this looks like a good flip up front, right? But guys, one thing I want to caution you guys about, with, especially with buying on Facebook Marketplace, is there's a lot of scams, like a lot of scams, okay? so. Um, I'm going to show you guys a different way and a safer way to do this um, that will help you 
you know, find items that are, you're going to be able to buy from like legit people because these, these, this one right here and this one down here, I mean, this one is quite obviously a fake phone uh, because it has the iPhone X. There's a lot of fake phones on Facebook marketplace. Okay. But what a lot of people do is they will reach out and they'll, neg they'll negotiate a little bit, right? They'll figure out how much a device is selling for online. And then they will negotiate with the seller on Facebook marketplace and try to get that price for a little bit lower so that they can sell it online or to somebody else for a higher price. And uh, typically we make between you know, 50 to $150 per device that we buy and resell, okay? So there is an easier way to do this. Um, I personally do not reach out to people on Facebook marketplace. So I'm, you know, I just don't do it simply because of stuff like this. I don't wanna deal with it. So one thing we can do though is uh, post ads. So the first place that I recommend for posting free ads would be craigslist.org. So if you've never used Craigslist before, um, there you go. So we'll go to craigslist.org. And then you can post ads on platforms just like this. Okay, and I'll show you guys where to post it. Um, and then I'll show you guys some sample ads as well. Uh, I didn't type in the name right. There we go. So you'll want to create an account on Craigslist and then uh, you'll want to make a posting, right? And where you want to make the posting would be wanted, the wanted section here. You can post free ads in the wanted section and you'll be able to see um, some ads, you know, that I put up here. So here's one, you know, I'll buy your phones and electronics uh, on, on the spot today. This is me buying MacBooks. You guys can copy this ad for all I care, right? So you want to go post at least three ads a day on Craigslist and I make sure they're a little bit different each time. Um, and then you'll start getting uh, text messages. Now I do want to point out, you will get uh, some weird emails, people asking you to verify code. You'll want to ignore those. Okay. You'll want to ignore those types of, of messages. I'll kind of show you guys what those look like. So if we go here to my CRM, um, I can show you guys those real quickly. Let me show those to you. Okay, so here's a here's an ad here's a message from Craigslist. Hey, I saw you're looking to, for to buy a broken PS4. If you're interested, I still have one available. Hey, look at that. There's a lead I got to respond to this morning. They hit me up at 1:30 a.m. Uh, so this right here would be an example of a, a a phishing ad. So don't respond to these. I never respond to these uh, because they are quite obviously not. Also, one thing you want to recommend definitely pay attention to is the area code that this stuff is being sent from. Okay. So that's another thing. Uh, there's another one right here, but here's one from Craigslist that, uh, that that's a good one. Right. So, and then uh, here's one that's obviously another spam as well. So, yeah. <clears throat> so that's Craigslist, right? Now, another place you can post on is uh, Facebook groups. So if we go to Facebook groups, what you'll want to do is join a couple of buy, sell, trade Facebook groups near you. So um, let's type in buy near me. Just like this. And then you'll have a couple of them pop up and you'll want to join at least, you know, like as many as you can. So you'll see there's a lot in the area right here, right? So, you know, we'll go to this group and I'll kind of give you guys an outline on how to do this, right? So the reason we're posting ads, guys, is simply because we want people to message us. We don't want to be messaging people all day because that's exhausting and it takes a lot of time. Okay, so we would rather have people message us. Uh, as you can see right here, you know, this person messaged me. Typically, when somebody messages you, they are much more likely to sell the device than you reaching out to somebody who is all, they already have their price determined on what they want, right? So um, that's why we, that's why I recommend ads, okay? So you'll want to post in the discussion area and uh, you'll want to post something, you know, like this, looking to buy, and I like to do this, used damaged electronics, iPhone X and newer, newer 
or Samsungs, and you guys can just start off with you know these. And then what you'll want to do is you'll want to find um, an ad photo. So here we go. Let's find an ad photo here real quick. Let me grab one here. And you can probably nowadays you can probably find these online. Um, so here's one. So you'll want to post an ad similar to this in Facebook groups. And I recommend posting it into three to five Facebook groups um, to get optimal responses and people messaging you. So um, that's another place. And then the last place that I recommend, which is a little bit advanced, would be uh, run paid Facebook ads. Now, if you're not ready for paid strategies, then I recommend uh, using the free strategies that I just gave you guys. And uh, that's how that works. Right. So this is kind of how you guys start flipping phones. This is how that works. Um, you know, this is what phone flipping is. Uh, we, we post ads, we buy devices, we figure out what that device is going to, well, we actually figure out what that device is going to sell for before uh, we actually make the offer. And that's how we make money flipping phones, guys. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, if you guys want more content like this, uh, actually, if you just drop in the comments whatever content you want. I really like to see what people want to hear about. And uh, I'll drop some more content about that stuff. Uh, you guys give me new ideas every single week uh, based on your comments. So um, yeah, guys, remember to like, subscribe, and uh, leave, me a, leave me a comment if you want to. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video.